Hey, what's up? Hello, welcome to or welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Emma, and if you're not new here, my name is still Emma. So this is the much anticipated new year room tour. So I'm gonna go in here now because it's really chilly out here. But this is my door. This is my room number. It'll mean absolutely nothing to you unless you're here. This is Beth. She's actually my neighbour over there, but. Her thing ended up on my door, so that's cool. And then this is what Alec did. Shout out to what's this Twitch username? Swap. 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 I don't know. I don't know. Anyway, he went there and he like printed out all of our in dictionary things. This is my key. I like this. Like a hotel. Really cool. I like it. This is my room. I'll shut the door behind you. I was I would pin it open, but I don't actually have a door stop. I mean, Use this jandle as a doorstop. Which I also wear in the shower because it's really gross. So anyway, this is inside my room. So, yep. Where should I start? Oh, Rachel's behind the camera, by the way, guys. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so this is the light switch. Awesome. And this light here open, like turns on when I open my wardrobe, which is actually kind of annoying because Rachel's room is right next door and hers stays on like... 24-7. Like, like when you turn no. on the main light, it turns on too. Anyway, this is inside my wardrobe. So you don't have like a whole heap of space. I've got like this jackets and merch, which if you're watching this now, this is available. And this lanyard here is also probably available. So yeah, this is all my jumpers. Down there's like my washing basket and my clean towels and stuff and my handbag and washing detergent and stuff. And then these are like my country road bags. So if I go home for the weekend or go to Owens for the weekend, I can just use one of those. These are like all my t-shirts, which I'm actually going to show you because I'm kind of proud of myself. I folded them like Marie Kondo. <laughs> and that's that. And then in the other, all the boxes are from Kmart, by the way. I'll have everything I can find. I will link down below for you guys, otherwise I'm going to get like a million questions. But the boxes are from Kmart, and in this one here, in the bottom one, is my winter clothes. Like, scarves, beanies, gloves. That's my wardrobe. And then this is like our shelving situation. So this is just like books. These are kind of cute actually. I want to get like a pencil thing to put these in because they're really cute and have like meaningful sayings on them. Like live with passion, enjoy the simple things. But as I, I, I process it at the start of the video, but my room is not finished. There's some things I still want to get, but I get questions every time I vlog in this room. So I just want to get a room to up. So I stop getting questions about it. I get lots of questions about this too. My Polaroid printer, that's how I do that. My blue light glasses, this is Popper's funeral notice because I miss Popper. Speaker, jewelry box, the daily edited scrunchies from Pop with Poppy. Perfume, this is like my food situation. So this has like just food in there. And these are my plates. I got weird prints because I figured if they ended up, like I ended up leaving them somewhere then I'd know they're mine. And this is like my medicines and games and stuff. So this is my paper here, so this is for my printer. Because I bought a printer, you don't actually need a printer at university, they have ones you, they have ones you can use here, right? I like, think so. so. I just got my own because like I have to print out a lot of stuff for like YouTube and my website and stuff. Um, so if you're coming back up here, so yeah, that sort of stuff. That's just my Lux Fitness box for the brand deal I did. Undies, sanitary products, bras and socks. This is my workout clothes in here. These baskets have been came out, by the way. And then that's just my jeans and sweatpants and stuff. My Udi up there. This is like, it's kind of like a Neutron Ninja, but mum had it at home and she had a Neutron Ninja, so I just took that one. My textbooks, my binders, one for each of my um, classes, and then a thing here for each of my classes as well. So if I get any loose paper, I can just chuck them in. And then as far as my actual desk goes, just, I mean, it normally stays pretty clear, because I like leave my clear space, clear mind. My laptop, my phone, obviously I don't stay there all the time. And then tissue box, lamp also from Kmart. You got me this, where's this from? Kmart. <laughs> okay, okay, Kmart, It might not actually be from Kmart. It might be from the warehouse, so I don't know. And then I have my timetable and stuff on the wall. A little, I made this on Photoshop, but just like a little calendar with, that's a photo of Owen and I from this time last year. Fun fact for you. And this is actually what I was going to do yesterday afternoon. That didn't really happen. We ended up singing to iCarly. And... Yeah, we got a bit distracted. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I shouldn't say that because now you're wondering. Wait, no, you're going to know that it was us. us. So you're probably wondering why this is up here. So this is a lifesaver, okay? I was going to take it down for the video, but you guys need to understand this is how this is what university Uni is life. Like. Yeah, so this is from Briscoe's. I actually got it the other day. It was like $8 or something. It's supposed to go over a door, but... 
the curtain rail works too. So I just hang my towel and my bath mat and my tea towel up there. And this heater is really, oh they're still on. Oh they're turning the heaters off I think. Um, but the heat is like controlled by like the actual university so we can control the temperature thing. Um, like I have it on full because it's mm. cold. I like your view. Yeah, this I'm um, um, the troll under the bridge. So we get two chairs in our room, so I have another chair just chilling over here. That's the other one. Oh, and also under my desk oh, yeah. is my shoe rack. That's also from came out in my bin. And then we have like, I don't know, do you have one of these? This little... Yeah, I do. Towel? Yeah, so I just have my um, face cloth and hand towel thing on there. And then these scary lights, which my nana got me for my birthday, which are from my mum's pharmacy, actually. So that's cool. This was from the warehouse, which I had at home in my bed, but I bought it to uni and this is from Bed Bath & Beyond, I got that ages ago and yep this is also from Bed Bath & Beyond and that's king sized and this is a king single bed so this is like massive duvet cover is from Briscoe's and it is the abode or full cover then this is my Polaroid wall you guys know I'm obsessed with Polaroid photos those are photos from like 2016 to like last week so this is my European, oh there's like yeah also there's chocolate on my duvet shout out to Morgan, she spilled chocolate on there Literally the first day we got back after I washed it, but it's okay. European pillow, normal pillow, pillows, yeah, cool. This is the uni calendar that we get like for free. And this is a calendar which um, my brother's girlfriend got me from Australia. I actually love it so much. Yeah, it's so cute. And it's got like things you can write like what I'm grateful for and this month I will. And like cute little quotes. Where did you get it? She got it from a bookstore I think, but it's by this person Meredith. I think her last name's Gaston. And then these fairy lights which I got in Secret Santa. I think they're from Farmers. Because you've got the same ones. Right? Yeah. Then this little dog, which is called, um, I don't know, I think I called it Nemo, or maybe I called it Doggo. Or maybe, anyway. It's from Owen's parents, I got it for my 18th birthday. This is Polar Bear, and this is Dolphin. That's their actual names. Underneath here, we have this, oh, also there's a light switch here, which controls the light up there. So this cupboard literally goes all the way right back like behind the bed so normally i'd have my longboard in there but i didn't bring my longboard back with me because i don't have enough space for it so in here i have like my shower caddy the one has like my skincare and the other one has like my shampoo and stuff and then under here what is that my tripod my microphone my drawing tablet and then clothes that i'm selling and then if we come across here <laughs> <behind you. laughs> this is just a random cupboard so some of the rooms here had drawers eh in this part yeah, like Morgan yeah, does and I Jess. I would rather have drawers to be honest, but this just has like, down here is like, um, merch stuff, my hair straightener, and my chargers, which I just chuck in a shoe box, and that's just like random stationery, which is really messy, because I don't really know how to make it look tidy. This is like, oh this is my bag, I get lots of questions about what bag I use for uni. This is the bag I use, it is a status anxiety fall of hearts bag, and it's enough to fit like my laptop, whatever textbook I need, it's got like pockets and stuff for whatever, which is really good, really expensive, but really good. I feel like this video would be helpful, like, would you find this helpful if you were like moving into college hall and want to know? Yeah, I think I'd want to know like the size, because it's actually kind of small. Like, we've, we're on like the block, we're on the no drinking floor, so our rooms are kind of smaller, like in this block, than other blocks, I reckon. Well, they originally created D block before C block. Okay, that might be wrong, but that's what I've been told. And so they made these rooms first, and then they realised... They were too small. They were too small, so then they made C block, and then made them a bit bigger. Oh, okay. That's what yeah. I'm just assuming, but... So, this is kind of, like, I know it looks small, and I'm used to, you guys know, if you watch my channel, my room at home is, like, quite a lot, like, probably twice the size of this. But, like, you've learned to make do with it. Like, it's so cosy, eh? Yeah, I love it. Like, I remember walking in here the first time and my room was like empty and I was like, I cannot stay here. But like, once you get like your like bed set up and you get like some photos on the wall and you put your stuff on the shelves, it feels so homely. Mm. Um, so this would be useful for like people like who want to know what college rooms look like or uni rooms in general, what to bring to uni, cute things to put in your room at uni. <laughs> yeah. I know I get a lot of questions about whether we have to share our rooms with people because I feel, I've, is that what people do in America, do you know? I feel like there are halls or like places where you have to share. Yeah, well we don't. We oh, people might remember the bathroom situation. Should we share the bathrooms? Oh, that could be good. Okay, let's go to the bathrooms. What if that's like kind of a bad look on my kiddo though? I feel like our bathrooms are good though. Yeah, true. Okay, we'll just go down the hallway. <laughs> this uh, is our hallway. Is that's my room. This is the bathroom. Oh. Hey guys, I'm in sweats and a jumper. <laughs> Hello, girls. 
Hello. Do you, know, do you want to be in my video? Why not? <laughs> oh, this is Anne. She's our lovely cleaner. She runs around after us and cleans up our mess. Like when we spit our toothpaste and it goes all over the sink, she cleans it up for us. <laughs> yeah, she does a great job. She's a hero. And these guys are really awesome. They don't make too much of a mess. <laughs> awesome. Thank you. Thank you. So yeah, we get four sinks and then that's like where we all brush, brush our teeth and stuff. And then there's a toilet around in here which has its own sink and stuff. Toilet. There's two showers on this side and there's a another toilet in there and then across the hall there's another room with three toilets and then what's there down that end? A toilet and two showers. There's one toilet down, I don't know actually, I've never been down there. So there's 27 people on this floor, we have four showers, six toilets and five sinks. Anyway, so. Okay, that's the entrance by the way when you want to go out. This is Alec, this is his toilet. Oh. Subscribe. This is our chalk art, which our RA Liam did. Shout out to Liam, the best RA in college hall. What was the theme? Like a nice 80s. 80s. Oh, I don't know. Neon, was it? So there's like so. noodles and stuff, which are like neon lights. And this is like our lounge area. And then this is our kitchen area. So we run our own kitchen. Yeah, and then we have our own kitchen. And then we have like our foods all cooked for us. So this is just like if we want snacks. Like a lot of people cook noodles in here. And we have like a fridge. We'll make coffee. Yeah. And there's like a like table here. We normally just stand here and talk. Yeah. Or like. And there's a calendar with our birthdays on it. Whose birthday's next? This is like our pin board. 20, what are we? 22nd of May. Whose birthday's next? Alex. Alex's birthday on the 18th. Oh no, he's turning 18 on June 5th. Shall we get back to my room and finish it up? Yep. Welcome back in. So hopefully this gives you guys a bit of a better understanding of like the situation. So hopefully I won't get so many questions. You will get so many questions. I'm gonna get so many questions. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, I guess I should say, if there's anything else you wanna know about, I mean, I can't really, like, every university is different, so you kind of need to like, you know, have a look around. So most places have like more than one place you can stay. So I know for example my brother goes to Massey in Albany, they only have one halls of residence and it's like really fancy um because it's like new. But here we have three different halls of residence so the one we're in which is like, this is like the fancy one eh? Well, yeah. Not fan I won't say fancy, it's just like the expensive one. Should I say how much it is a week or is that? You could give a estimate oh, it says price. Online, doesn't it? It's like is it three hundred and seventy dollars a week, or is it four hundred and something? No, I'm pretty sure it's three hundred and seventy. Um, but what's the full? I think the full price is in the four hundreds. Surely not. I think it is like oh, four hundred and something. I thought it was three seventy. Oh, maybe it is three seventy. But you can stay here and like not have to like you can cook your own foods. So they have a whole block which isn't as nice as this. Like it hasn't been. These have been renovated, which is like I've actually been there. Have you been there? No. Um, but they have their own kitchens and stuff, so they can like cook, um, like communal kitchens. But on the other side of campus, there's Student Village, so Studville or Bryant Hall. So Bryant Hall's, I haven't been there before. I have a few friends over there, shout to you, Liv. But that's like pretty similar situation to this, where you can like have be like fully catered and stuff. Is Studville? That's you can only do self catered there, I think. Okay, eh? could be wrong. I was wrong. We have researched and we have discovered that you can stay at Studville and Bryant Hall, and you can be fully catered at both of them, and it costs you three hundred and twenty-two dollars a week. But they're like in like little like apartments. So there's, I would say, similar. Like if you've been to look at AUT's ones, they have like, is it like five people and you have like shared bathroom and stuff? Hopefully, this was helpful in some way, shape, or form. Otherwise, if you're just nosy like me and want to see what my room looks like, then I hope you liked it. This is, please, if you, some of you may know, I have a diploma in interior design. This is not a reflection on my interior design skills whatsoever. But apart from that, thank you guys so much for watching. Stay safe, stay well, make someone smile, and I'll see you on my next video. Pause, you can cut this out. Am I allowed to laugh? Yeah, sure. That makes me sound funnier. We need another 15 seconds. I love people watching. That sounds not in a creepy way. Like, I just like watching people. <laughs> <laughs> it's not like you can say this. so creepy. Like, watching cars drive by. I find it entertaining. Welcome to my crib. Welcome to my crib. Yeah. Where's the microphone? Like on the very top. Oh, okay. I need mine. Scrap that. <laughs>